Now, there's a lot happening in the world. I know that you are checking it out and feeling it in your bones. And as we uh, enter into this kind of third week of Black History Month, I am thinking about the words to the beautiful poem we sung. We have come over a way that with tears has been watered. And I wanna invite you to take a deep breath and think about your own journey. Think about the ways over which you have come. And by you, I mean, like as in the Zulu uh, fashion, Ubuntu, you means you, you means your people, you means your ancestors, it means your deities, it means your God, it means our Christ. So take a deep breath. And as you exhale, think about the way over which you've come and the way that we can journey together toward fierce love. Let us pray. Holy One, you have never promised us a rose garden, but you have promised us presence. You have promised us liberation. You have promised us deliverance. You have promised us safe passage, safe in your arms, safe in your bosom, safe to feel loved, safe to feel protected, safe to feel supported. And God, we thank you for that. Thank you that even in this time of incredible grief, incredible loss of life, incredible suffering and struggling, if we just close our eyes and take a breath, we can access your Holy Spirit at work around us and inside us. When we take a breath, it is a sacrament. It is a sign and a symbol of the present reality that you don't change. You don't leave. You do not desert your people. You are here as comfort, as way, as path guiding our feet, lighting our way. Help us as we begin this Lenten journey together, Holy One, to lean on that confidence. You've got us. You're holding us. You're feeling with us what we feel. Thanks be to you, O oh God, that you entered into our lives as Black flesh, as Black Nazarene rabbi flesh, poor outsider, marginalized flesh, which lets us know how much you understand our human experience. Help us to live as though we are loved by you, loving one another fiercely, compassionately, and empathically all along the way to new life. This is our prayer, Holy One.